Hey geeks, it's Andrea. Believe it or not, we are already on day 21 of Horror Month 2017. We only have a third of the month to go. You know, saying that out loud feels a lot longer than I thought it would. Anyway, <laughs> today we're going to take one last look at some two sentence horror stories. I really wanted to spread these out more. I'm sorry about them being all a bit close together. This has been a really weird year for me and this month has just been non-stop craziness. So it makes sense that the order of the videos would be messed up, doesn't it? All right, geeks, let's go. You hear your mom calling you into the kitchen. As you're heading down the stairs, you hear a whisper from the closet saying, Don't go in there, honey. I heard it too. 14. Being buried alive was bad enough. Realizing I wasn't alone in my own grave was worse. 13. You get home, tired after a long day's work and ready for a relaxing night alone. You reach for the light switch, but another hand is already there. They say practicing smiling in front of a mirror makes you feel happier. I wish my reflection would join along. 11. They delivered the mannequins in bubble wrap. From the main room, I begin to hear popping. 10. You walk through your home and find a door you've never seen before. The knob twists. 9. You're laying in bed with your feet dangling out of the covers. You feel a hand grab your feet. For years, we heard the little voices and footsteps of the ghost children in our old farmhouse, and we got used to them. Then one day they went quiet, which should have been our own cue to leave. Seven. I woke up to hear knocking on glass. At first, I thought it was the window, until I heard it come from the mirror again. Six. The funeral attendees never came out of the catacombs. Something locked the crypt door from the inside. Five. You know that weird full body twitch you get sometimes when you're falling asleep? If there was a camera pointed at you and you saw what it captured at that moment, you'd never sleep again. Four. After struggling desperately to move any part of his paralytic body, just to alert the doctors that he was conscious before they made the first incision, he was relieved to see that one of the nurses had noticed his pupils dilating from the bright light. She leaned in close, and in a whisper that tickled his ear said, You think we don't know you're awake? Three. You start to drift off into a comfortable sleep when you hear your name being whispered. You live alone. Two. My grandfather, who died of Alzheimer's several years ago, refused to let the house lights be turned off at night. The light he offered was the only thing keeping the dark men away. What? There was a picture in my phone of me sleeping. I live alone. All right, geeks, that's going to do it for this video. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today. If you have any two-sentence horror stories of your own, be sure to type them in the comments while you're hitting that subscribe button and liking the video. The t-shirt isn't going to be available much longer before it's gone forever, so be sure to get your hands on it while you can. All right, geeks, I will see you tomorrow.